Hello everybody, Triple here, and welcome to another Shonan Live, and we have more Hisuian Pokemon to check out, and this one, I'm actually focusing on Overquill, and I'm using this very interesting offensive set, uh, I'm gonna see if I can switch the third types, because I haven't really paid attention to the third types yet, um, I'm gonna Terra Fire on this just because it's handy, Terra Fairy, uh, you need to be Terra Ghost, and you need to be... I, I'm actually gonna make you turn ground. No, turn ground. I think. Or turn water. Not uh, turn ground is fine. I'm probably not gonna use that anyway, but uh, focus around Overquill. And that's because of one very big thing here in Barbarage. Barbarage is a 60 base power move. It's stab on this on a pretty good attack set, but it doubles in power if it's the, the target is poisoned. So I paired it with Toxic Spikes from Float Pro here, and uh, yeah, that's Barbara is going to do a bunch of damage. I have Crunch uh, as the other stab. I have Fell Stinger. If I can get something down with this, I get a big attack buff. And then I have Aqua Jet, um, which is nice for the extra priority. I'm pretty strong, and if I get a Fell Stinger off, that Aqua Jet is going to hurt. Uh, the whole idea here is with Intimidate, I can come in and Barbarage stuff and do a lot of damage. I have that scroll with the Toxic Spikes, of course, with also Rapid Spin here, so we're gonna have to be careful with this a bit. Earth Power and Giga Drain uh, are just both very good stabs. Uh, Terra Fire is a good defensive, uh, especially since everything that comes in on my Fire type is weak to Giga Drain, so... I have to focus Sash so I can get both layers of Toxic Spike up for the bar Barrage to put in a lot of work. Dragapult is here with Sub Wisp Disable Hex. Um, it's my standard um, set, um, but with Hex and the Toxic Spikes, we're gonna be able to put in a little damage, not to mention the bar Barrage initial like chance to poison. So Hex is gonna do very well late game. Uh, it also shuts down a lot of Pokemon that are like a problem right now. Um, and I think it's gonna be very good there. Iron Valiant is here physically because I have all special attackers almost. Uh, with Spirit Break, Swords Dance, Psycho Cut, Strength Punch because it's, it hits most things uh, and it outspeeds a lot of them because of the booster energy. Uh, with the Swords Dance up, this can put in a lot of damage, and with Terra Psychic, I, I, I become hard to hit, because Spirit Break, Psycho Cut hits everything uh, that would try to hit me, uh, except for Ghost Types. Ghost Types are a bit of a problem, but we do, again, have Overcoil. Volcanion is here. Uh, hold up. How much speed does this have? 295. I'm actually going to make this bulky instead of speedy and make this element there we go that could be way more interesting Volcanion! Volcanion is here with with an assault vest Volcanion is a mod that i've used a ton before it's really good uh, steam eruption fire blast is such good coverage with sludge bomb to hit fairies and then i have terra fairy terra blast just in case uh, a lot of things switching in on this were like Dragonites and stuff like that. So if I can get a fairy type hit off on that, that's very nice. And then last of all, I have Zapdos with U-Turn Discharge Hurricane Roost with the st Static, which hopefully some something attacks into that and takes a lot of damage from me. Um, we'll have to see about that. But yeah, it's a very interesting team. Uh, it's actually a variant of an earlier team. I'm gonna have to revise that team because it had... Um, it's doing an Avalon on it, and I think that's also, that should be its own video. So, for now, I'm gonna leave it at this, and yeah, we'll see how this does. And here we go, I think Overquill actually does pretty nicely here. Uh, Zapdos is a pretty safe lead on almost everything, so I think that's my play here, yeah, because I get a... There's no way you stay in here. I hurricane into the Great Dusk, yeah. Nice crit to start things off. A 
and we instantly put him on the back foot. He does go Roaring Moon here, so I U-turn. He, if he attacks me here, he has a chance to get static. Exactly. Um. Hmm. I'm actually gonna get my T spikes up here. He is still faster, so that makes me believe. Oh no, we're speed tied. He's probably Scarf. I need to get him lower. I don't think this Barbarage kills here. Yeah, exactly. And now, Fell Stinger. Give me that attack buff. Give me that. What is your answer now? Rodon Wash, that's adorable. I'm gonna actually click Crunch here, because if he goes Cool then go, we hit that. Uh, same with Slow King. Yeah, exactly, he full switches here. And he gives me the Slow King. And he gives me the Braviary. Oh no, okay. I just charge there. As he is the speedy variant. Is he scarf on this? No. Oh wait, wait, yeah, no, I'm stupid. Um, however, I click Slush Bowl now. I just got to keep, keep clicking this button. It's cool that he's trying to uh, spread around uh, status. Oh, I'll get it. I'll get a hit off on this. Perfect. And he misses. So now we just win with our Iron Valiant. And we left that because of the Assault Pass. Yeah. Okay. Overpool actually putting me in a very good position there. I should have probably Aqua Jetted the Braviary. Um, I think it was Scarf, but but yeah, the Fell Stinger there put us in a very good position. And we run... Oh, he has an Arcanine. That's actually... He has three Rock types. Against my Toad Scroll. Which I can lead, lead against, like, his entire first part of his team. I'll put up my T-Spikes there. I'll sub on them. Die. Now we have T spikes here. Probably Ghost Glamora to clear them off. Um, I will hit this.
cool. Now I'm on a timer, but I can still do a lot of damage to your entire team. And I have Drain Punch against these three. He e speeds me, I'm pretty sure. But I don't know if it's gonna be enough. Yeah, it's not enough, and we train punch all of that back. And I drain punch all of that back. And I spirit break you for a lot of damage. And kill. And now I just drain punch. Inevitably. He tried to play around it, but he didn't do it well because I have no reason to predict anything. As he is Aqua Jet and it doesn't even matter. Both of his priority just doesn't kill. Give me my HP back. I mean, it's very simple here, right? I SD and then I click Drain Punch over and over and I kill you in two hits. Yep, now I Drain Punch and I get all my HP back and I do more than half to you. Aha! Uh -huh. Great, thank you. Fair and balanced Pokemon. <laughs> Thing Lulu Lokix. Okay, Iron Valiant looks insane here. Uh, Lethal Canyon. Okay, yes, yeah, sure. Uh, I steam more option here because I resist the first impression. So you should switch out here. Probably into Samurott, into Ting Lu. That took a lot of damage. For stall. No burn, but... I think this is my best use of... Yeah, exactly! Of Terra anyway. Nance got outplayed the hardest he's ever been. Plus we resist first impressions still. And we have Water Absorb against the Samrods. And we resist Ceaseless Edge. Yeah, no, we still have Water Absorb, buddy. <laughs> Terra Fairy Falkenian is surprisingly like really good. Uh, ooh, okay. Um, not fun. Lead Toad Spool. Ah, yeah, get it right here. Okay, hold up. Get it right. Dude. I'm very much saying he's gonna switch to like Sneasler or Roaring Moon here. So I'm gonna double to Vulcanian. <coughs> oh, that also works actually. I'll Steam Eruption this. I'll go over Quill. And Crunch you. Get out of here.
he is disrespectful. And I don't appreciate it. He is speedy, somewhat. What if I sub on him? Yep, now I'm behind a sub and you have a Valiant and a Moon that Nina likes to get burned. Uh-huh. Get the fuck out of here with that. As he is an attack photosynthesis. However. As he drops a Draco, which actually is perfect for me, because uh, yeah, I just SD here. <coughs> I uh, cycle cut you. I think he may have put me in a position to win here with Scarf Boat Scroll. Pokanian is still at full health too, so. If that, this is a speed tie, I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure he's just Scarf. might not be Scarf. And if he's not Scarf, I click Arf Parker. I'm pretty sure you died too. Yeah. I think him giving me the scarf actually, yeah, yeah, that cost me the win. That that was very nice of him to give me that scarf. Okay, okay, yeah, good. Um, Lethal Canyon is incredibly good here because we click Fire Blast immediately off rip. And that's a dead scissor. <laughs> I don't know what he was planning with that. But with Terra Fairy here, we're incredibly well off. Yeah, because with Terra Fairy here, we Terra Blast. He gets a layer of spikes up, which is annoying, but we can rapid spin those away later. We eat those and it dies. Uh, I steam eruption this because I have AV and I steam eruption this because it does big damage. And I actually fire blast here just in case he goes into Lilligan. Okay, steamer option for a chance of a burn.
I go to burn. I uh, spin here. Thank you. I uh, click here right on you a few times. Because yes, that does a lot of damage, but... I'm pretty sure he moonlights here. Oh no, he doesn't. He just gives me this, I guess. Thank you. I click Barbara here. I don't really have to. Actually, no. I shouldn't have done that. I didn't poison either way. I'm gonna Aqua Jet just cause nice. Hello. Okay. And now you bring in Lilligant, and that does what? It sleep powders me, and then I go into Valley Ice Spinner. Okay, of course I miss another Hurricane. Very cool, except the fact that, um, yeah. Cool. And this also dies. Exactly. Again, Vulcanian putting in the work there. Ooh. Okay, uh, Vulcanian, go. Vulcanian is actually insane here. Hold up. Hit me. Yeah, no. Goldengo comes in. Cool. I U-turn on you. And Volcanion <laughs> clicks Terror Blast! And that kills back Excalibur! <laughs> That's actually huge! What are you... No. Okay, well, thank you. I still have Water Absorb. Why is that so hard to understand? Okay, so funny news is Overquill does get ground... It gets Fighting Type Courage. And it's called Reversal. I'm leading Volcanion because look at this team and look at Volcanion. Ceaseless Edge me right now. But yeah, no, Overcoat gets reversal, and with Intimidate, I could probably live a hit from Ursa Luna. He was sashed, so he's gonna see his edge and I'm gonna rapid spin it all away. Cool. Thank you. And I'm speedy now, so he has to kind of go denied. Which I don't really mind if he does. He could try to go Sneasler here, but I think I outspeed it. Oh, that's even better! Because I Giga Drain this. Exactly! People forgot what Toad Screw did, because nobody ever uses it, but yeah. Oh, buddy! You aren't Balloon? Well, your Balloon would have popped anyway from the Giga Drain. Heat and Ice here. We have full Canyon, still very full. Aha, we Wisp. He doesn't have the best switch to this. 
because I could just drop a Draco, but yeah, no, he just gives me Tusk. But I'm in a very good position right now. Because yeah, I wisp this. I give him Toad Scroll, I'm pretty sure. He's Guts anyway, so... Yeah. I intimidate him, and I click Reversal. Hit me. I am very bulky, hit me. Don't kill me, please. Ah, come on. It would have been funny. I click Steamer option. Flame charge? I click Steamer option here. I don't have to think about anything. Steamer option kills this and has a chance to burn the knight as sleeper. I do have AV, so yeah. That's a good trade, I'm willing to make that trade. We have Iron Valiant in the back, so I'm not all too worried. I have Drain Punch for the Ursula Luna. I have uh, whatever for the other two. I'm gonna Terra Blast this. Because I think he has to D-Dance up on me. And now he can't de dance again, or I'll kill him. Great. Hit me. Okay, I'll barbarize you then. It's whatever for me. That is a toxic set. Wait a second, hold up. That's not a toxic set. You can't touch me. I can't touch this, to be fair. So we're kind of at an impasse here. You can touch me, I can touch you. So uh, yeah, have fun burning to death. Exactly. Ursa Luna. I didn't. The thing is, I thought last game, but I didn't even realize that Ursa Luna was even still allowed. I thought people were talking about banning this one. Uh, Lethal Canyon is really good. Gotta see more option here on the Cresselia. Yeah, that's a good burn. Okay. Earthquake me. Right now. Hold up. Now he goes up to on this er on this earthquake. Uh huh. And I hurricane because he has no real hurricane switch ends. And he's confused now. Cool. Give me this. He's just hard to roaming. And it's really just not fun. Crunch. Goodbye, Cresselia. No more trick room for you. Go your slow king, in fact. Yeah, give me this too. Ah, you really needed that... Wait, hold up. I 
I have a sash. I can get a T-spike off here and he can't remove them anymore. And that gives me barbarages on literally everything. Cool. Uh, the eject pack's out, which is pretty cool, I guess. Um, yeah, sure. You did it. Uh, what do I need the least? I guess you can take bolt for me. Kill me. I'll sub up here, just in case. Yeah, you, you killed that. Barbrage! Bar barrage, but again, switch something in on this. Doesn't that have negative priority? Wow, you sure did take 47%. I don't think you kill me. I have my Terra left. Get out of here. Terra left for my Vulcanian, who wins in the end. Nice job, good job. You did it. Go back into Overquill and clip Bar Barrage again. He's heavy duty boots also. Wow, you did it. You have rocks up. I, I think Overquill still wins here. Because you got a chilly reception off into Hoopa. I don't think Hoopa kills me with anything. And I think Hoopa dies. It would be so funny though. Hold up. It killed! It killed! It fucking killed! Let's go, Bell Stinger! <laughs> but yeah, Oracle had a very good matchup there. He didn't have anything to hit it too offensively besides Ursaluna. Which he let go in trade for my Dragapult, so... Okay, interesting. Overquill actually looking pretty good. I kind of want the reversal hit the heat trend. Yeah, exactly, this was very likely. Uh, I'll click Crunch here on what I'm expecting to be heat trend. He has to U-turn here. Wait, I should have fell stingered. If he stays in here, right? Put up your spikes or your three spikes or whatever. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> One layer of spikes in trade for 902 attack at full health. Yeah, what is your answer? Show it to me. <laughs> Night. Oh, you don't say. Uh, no. You did it. You sure did. 28%. I, I, I get hurt by my black sludge now, which is unfortunate. But also look at the amount of damage this is doing. That killed surprisingly enough while well, I am flying type, but look at the damage I did now and look at Iron Valiant against this team. Hey buddy! I don't have Terra Fairy, which is annoying against the Backscalibur, but I can slouch bomb that if I need.
could have actually went Toad Screw. I shouldn't have. I'm, I'm fine without Toad Screw, I think. 74%. And I got a spin for these spikes. Yeah, sure. And I hit something now. I don't think Aqua Jet at plus zero kills me. So I'm gonna get it right here. It does kill me. However, <laughs> discharge. I'm not scared of these last two because I do have Iron Valiant. I'm gonna lose here on an Aqua Jet. Ah, buddy! Getting damage on this as well. I appreciate it. That's like the last thing I needed because, yeah. Uh, I, I will, I'm gonna bring in Valiant and just win. Uh, can you kill me, please? Yeah, can, can you please kill me? Thank you! Hello! <laughs> He's gonna be poison type Excalibur. And I'm gonna psycho cut it. Azumarill surprisingly doesn't die but is fully paralyzed so that's unfortunate for him show me the terror poison terra dragon okay interesting cool um, I, I think I still win. If he lets me get this, yeah, okay, I definitely win. I sludge bomb. I don't think you kill me with earthquake. Yeah, no, you don't. See, it's fine. Okay, um, we lead Volcanion, that's just... <laughs> yeah. Vol lead Volcanion does insane here. Hello! Goodbye! I go Zipdos here. Volcanion is way too good in this matchup. You just... Okay. He is disrespectful. Know that. I can get right here. Unless he's Scarf. Which would be a problem. I should have probably went for Kenny in here. Because then I get another strong hit off. Yeah, no. I can get right in here. Now I'm I'm at size percent, so I rapid spin. And then I would speed and earth power him. Booster Spatek means uh rapid spin guaranteed outspeeds me him here. So he dies now. Goodbye. And Amorous I'm okay with because I have overcoat with the bar barrage. Yeah, that's that's fair. Okay. Scary team. Uh Volcanian is very good against Welcome Wake, so we need to save that. 
Uh, lead Dutko. Because, yeah, that's a very likely lead of his. Okay, sure. Uh, I mean... Yeah, I'm gonna get those off anyway. I have overquill, so I'm like okay with this. Mystical fire. I'll spin here. Overquill. Click the button. Click this button. Because he really doesn't appreciate that. Yeah, no, goodbye. And he goes Great Tusk, which we don't really care about. He just puts up rocks because he is disrespectful. And he gives me that. Okay. Incredible. We have a Terra left here. So I'm looking really good. And now that's basically useless, that other option. So what we do is I go build, I sub up. And I start. Actually, I go over Quill and I click Barbarage. What are things you say? Ah, uh, thank you. I'll click Barbarize on this. Yeah, that's fine. I'll click Spirit Break. He might just turn normal, but... That's a good hit. I don't know if E-Speed kills you. Kills here. Yeah, exactly. So now I'm in a very good position. And I would gladly hit this. Hi there. Um, goodbye. Ah! You thought you could switch in on me. I see. You don't have anything to hit me with. No. <laughs> I don't know why you saved that. <laughs> Oracle there pressuring the Hatterene was basically all it needed to do. Um, the Bar Barrage on the, on like, the Knight was a, a threat, so he had to attack me, which is nice. I think this Pokemon is actually pretty good. Uh, Fell Stinger is more of a meme set, but it, it worked out sometimes. So, yeah, well... <laughs> We'll go with it. <laughs> Oracle is fun. I, I think a lot of the Hisuian Pokemon are very fun to use. Uh, minus, like, Cleaver uh, and um, uh, Samurott, because it's just kind of like, oh, they set hazards. That's it. They're, they're kind of identical to each other, too. But beyond that, like, a lot of the Pokemon, like Overquill, are very, very fun. And I, I, I also have a video in the works with Avalog that um, probably does hopefully pretty well. But with that, I really hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time.